Good evening, and welcome to Montevallo Music Machine. I'm your host, Jonathan Limbaugh, coming to you from Andy Jordan's studio in Strong Hall. Tonight, I'm pleased to introduce to you Dalton Green and Josh Cummings. Thank you. 
I'll tell you a little story. Getting pulled over on 31, two in the morning with a loaded gun. Play it cool, play it cool, play it cool, baby. Keep it copacetic, keep it nice, keep it tight. Play it cool, play it cool. Josh Green, uh, Dalton Green, and Josh Cummings, everybody. Stay tuned for an exclusive interview and more music after this. Your success depends upon effective communication. Visit montevallo.edu forward slash COFA. You create your future in communication studies and mass communication. You belong at Montevallo. Montevallo is listed as one of the most beautiful public college campuses, but it has so much more than good looks. It's been named a College of Distinction seven years running. Plus, it offers 75 majors and the chance to belong to more than 90 campus organizations. Visit youbelong at montevallo.com to learn more. <laughs> good evening. Welcome back to Montevallo Music Machine. I'm your host, Jonathan Limbaugh. Oh my God. I'm now here with our two guests, voice. Dalton Green and Josh Cummings. Dalton, Josh. Thank you for coming out with us tonight. The running. Uh, tell me a little bit about yourselves. Go ahead, man. Sure. Um, I'm from the Birmingham area. Uh, well, I was born in Jasper, and then we moved here and did all my schooling here in Hoover, Vestavia. Graduated from Vestavia. Um, I'm 24 years old. I uh, have a wife who just also turned 24. And we live in Mountain Brook, and I sing and have sang for as long as I can remember. Yep. Um, I went to school here at Montevallo. I graduated in 19, um, business management. I started selling cars at uh, Limbaugh Toyota. I um, found the woman I wanted to marry. We're getting married in September. I won't tell the date, somebody crashes it. And um, I started a little home studio at my house and I uh, called it Nautic Productions. Um, I started working, uh, he started working with me, but he had been there before and uh, he came to a Christmas party for the for us and he started singing karaoke uh it was good <laughs> so i was like okay i run a home studio so i reached out to him and asked him if he wanted to come out and make some music and uh he did and so here we are and um i'm excited as hell about the future so i see two are clearly passionate about music when did you realize you had this passion for it i mean for me i grew up it was kind of split between my dad 
we would listen to a lot of like southern rock, like Leonard Skinner, and then he would transition like he's he was born in the late '70s, so he's kind of a '90s like grew up in the '90s. So listen to a lot of grunge and a lot of stuff like that. And then my mom, it's Usher and Justin Timberlake, and but at the same time I grew up in church, so I, I've got a myriad of music. And just being <laughs> being passionate about it, it was like kind of like breathing or yeah. drinking water. It's just it's always been that way. Um. So, so I have Tourette's, and I, um, so if you know what that is, you have tics, and it makes you kind of muscles move when you don't want them to. And um, when I first started playing the guitar when I graduated high school, they kind of went away, and um, that grew the passion for music for me more than you know the average individual because you know it was healing me, and so that was that was nice, and um, that's why I call it Nautic Productions for no tick, and so that's where that came from. And he wanted to roll with it, and so that's what we did. I got ticks too. So do I. So you guys are blues musicians. So who are some of the blues artists that you've drawn inspiration off of? So first, this dude is not just a blues musician. This dude will sing whatever you want him to, um, and whatever he desires. I've heard it many times, and it's crazy. Um, I do love the blues. I, that's my root. Um, but we're venturing into some things that I don't you know, that most people ain't been listening to, and that's because of him, and I'm, I'm stoked. That album's coming out May 15th, and um, it'll be all over our social media pages, so um, that's gonna be a big day. Thank you. Where can people find this album when it comes out? Apple Music, Spotify, any, anything you can download to, to find it, you know, like all the digital platforms. Um, that's where it's gonna be, and maybe one or two videos on YouTube, that's but uh, big day's coming. <laughs> What do you see uh, for yourselves five, ten years down the road? You can answer that first I, if you I'm going to be honest with you. I don't look at the future. You know why? The reason why I don't look in the future is because if you start trying to shape your life into something you think it's going to be, you might take the wrong turns. I just want to take every minute as it comes because I ain't even promised ten years. So that's how I live, and that's how I'm going to do it. True. Yeah, I'm kind of the same way. I'm definitely, I'm like, I'm a Gemini, definition of a definition of a type B, um, so I definitely am not making any plans. <laughs> I'm definitely not. That's my wife is straight up type A stage manager. She makes all the plans, and then I just kind of roll with it. So, and that's the way our music goes too. He makes a song, and ten minutes later, we've got it recorded. So it's just kind of how we do it. Well, that couldn't be me. I understand where you're coming from. Though. <laughs> it's tough, man. Yeah. It's weird. <laughs> All right, well, thank you both so much. You're welcome, thank man. You. Oh, yeah, thank you. you, really. Stay tuned for more music. We'll be back right after this. Montevallo is listed as one of the most beautiful public college campuses, but it has so much more than good looks. It's been named a College of Distinction seven years running. Plus, it offers 75 majors and the chance to belong to more than 90 campus organizations. Visit youbelong at montevallo.com to learn more. At Montevallo, student safety is our priority. That's why our stunning college campus is one of the safest in Alabama. We're a tight-knit community looking out for one another. And we'll keep a lookout for you on campus. Visit youbelong at montevallo.com to learn more. Gain Welcome back to the show, everybody. Josh and Dalton are now here with more music for you. Oh 
Just 
tonight. Be sure to follow us on our social media platforms if you haven't already, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.